Welcome back, and pageants are happening all around the territory on St. Thomas. Mr. St. Thomas's organizer meets up with News Channel 8's Lee Carl. Again, here's Cobra Wayne Dawson, who's heading up this, uh, this event, which, by the way, went dormant for a little bit, but I just met the young people, and I say you've got a good crop. Uh, that's, the, that's the word I think. <laughs> Thank good you very crop. much. Um, we have the talent to show to all three islands, and like I said, we are going to be showcasing uh, Mr. American Virgin Islands on April 25th at Charlotte Money High School. And I like to say, you know, it took a while, but we are definitely going to present something that the male um, gentlemen on the Virgin Islands can showcase their talent and once again give the Virgin Islands an opportunity to showcase our talent at Mr. American Virgin Islands for Mr. USA pageant. Well, best luck for you. I know you're with the Boy Scouts and you've done a lot of work in the community. And uh, many times people always say, well, there's nothing to do. Well, here's something to do, right? Yes. Get ready to win. Now, if that person wins, what? what, what? They will be um, leaving in three months prior to the show to head up to the States to compete for Mr. USA 2009. And where would that be, roughly? Um, right now, that hasn't been announced, but in the very near future, I'll be um, announcing that to the, um, the viewing Rain, public. You're, I always uh, admire you for your hard work, and I think this is a great idea of putting, showcasing these young people and their talents, right? And yes. I think that's important, as we did with you many years ago, right? <laughs> Definitely. Right. <laughs> Been doing it for I was nice to thank you um, to the St. Thomas Carnival Committee for um, giving me the honor this year to be in a parade marshal for the Turin Parade. I heard about that. Yes, I heard about thank that. you. Yes. It says what, what Wayne Dawson is, better known as Cobra. In St. Thomas, for the upcoming uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. American Virgin, Mr. American Virgin on Freedom City, we're getting geared up for a big block party. Preparations are in order, and News Channel 8 cameras are there. We at our town, Frederick said, is excited, extremely excited about what we're going to be doing here on Saturday. We're going to be showcasing the development of this two square block area. And what you see behind me is one of the projects that we're going to be talking about is the renovation and restoration of the old Governor Farley's boyhood home and the uh, Adam Thomas music shop and, and residence here. We are going to have here on Prince Street a, uh, a street fair and we're inviting the entire public to come and look and see what we're going to be doing. I don't want to give too much details because we want you to come down here. We want you to come down here and see the enormous work that we've been doing. This is a, a public private partnership, a partnership between private organizations and government agencies in order to revitalize and renovate and restore this area of the town of Fredericksted. This is a demonstration project and we hope to transfer what we have done here to other uh, places in the town of Fredericksted. So please do come out on, on Saturday, the 28th of Fredericksted, uh, February. This coming Saturday to see what we're doing here. It's going to be a very exciting day. We're going to start at 11 o'clock and we're going to go till 5 o'clock. So you have a lot of time to come here to visit us and see what we're doing. T. Roy Augustine at the St. Croix Animal Welfare Center checks out the pet of the week. T. Roy. <laughs> Today's is Wednesday's pet. I'm at the animal shelter with Mr. Jonathan here, and he's going to tell you more about the little dog they have here. Mostly, I would think is a cheap way of having a security system. You get a dog. She's um, she's um, her name is Emma, and she's a half half breed pet bull, and she was a she's a stray, and she's a friendly dog. She and she likes kids. See that is good for kids. Get Emma. She has, she was a stray, which the animal shelter do pick up strays if you turn, bring them in and whatnot. The number of the animal shelter? Six, seven seven eight sixteen fifty. That's seven seven eight sixteen fifty. We're here with Emma. She's a half breed pet bull, so you know she'll make a great guard dog. Fun with kids. Come here at the animal shelter, located in Clifton Hill. I'm T Roy. Finish channel.